everyone, my name is Kaveri from Stiles Middle School. And I'm Alina. With pride and excitement, we and our ISD is celebrating success at the highest levels of competition. On the mat, in the pool, and even at the Capitol, students and staff are strutting their stuff. Let's start off with a big finish. Vandegrift High School's wrestling coach, Paul Muck, received some well-deserved recognition. The Texas High School Wrestling Coaching Association inducted Coach Muck into its Hall of Honor. With 23 years of coaching experience in Texas, Coach Muck was named Regional Coach of the Year seven times and State Coach of the Year in 2021. Congratulations, Coach! Let's get down to business with Leander ISD's purchasing office. This year, the Texas Association of School Business Officials presented an award of merit to the district's purchasing team. This award recognizes districts that show a commitment to following professional standards in the acquisition of goods and services. Way to go! On to state. Let's celebrate hashtag one LASD wrestlers who withstood daunting brackets and found a way to the podium of the UIL State Wrestling Tournament. Congratulations to Vandegrift High School's Zachary Hampton, who placed third and Rex Jacobs as a medalist. Cedar Park High School's Kane Sistrunk and Leander High School's Larson Patet also both medaled in their respective weight classes. A fantastic finish in UIL swimming and diving. Vista Ridge High School's Paula Warren won the gold in the girls 100 yard backstroke and Trinity Huang placed second in the girls 50 yard freestyle. Danny Bishop from Vandegrift took silver in the boys 200 yard freestyle and the Vipers boys team placed third in 200 yard medley relay. Cedar Park High School's Ella Mongenel won the gold in the girls 50 yard freestyle and took second place in the girls 100 yard freestyle. Michaela Colts took the gold in girls 100 yard breaststroke and third place in the girls 200 yard individual medley. Plus in the girls 200 yard medley relay, the CPHS girls team won the gold. The CPHS girls team also won the overall gold medal. CPHS diver Pierce Brooke won the gold in the boys' one-yard diving event, and Russ's Ellen McQuinn took third place in the girls' 100-yard freestyle. Watch out for that wave of winning. Last month, the Leander Lasers racked up powerlifting medals during the Special Olympics Winter Games state competition. Grabbing the gold, congratulations to Braden Arp, Joey Brick, Logan Weiss in the 19-23 to 23 age group. Jonah Meehan won both a gold and silver, and Scott Philpott won four in the 16-18 age group. Carver McDonald won silver, Sam Jones won fourth, and Luke Martins won fifth. This week, we are celebrating Texas Educational Diagnosticians Week. We are also appreciative of LISD's diagnosticians who play an integral role in the development of best practices, which guide policies of the campus and district level. Happy Educational Diagnostician Appreciation Week. We are fortunate to have you serving our students in Leander ISD. Because of your work, our students are able to receive the needed services um, and support to help them be successful in their learning environment. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and celebrate big this week. We appreciate their dedication to students, families, and district. Leander ISD's School and Community Relations Department brought back some hardware from the 2023 Texas School Public Relations Association State Conference. The SCR team tallied two Crystal Recommendation Certifications of Merit, eight gold stars, ten silver stars, and two bronze stars, recognizing the excellent work they do to tell our district story. It's Celebrate Texas Public Schools Week, and what better chance to celebrate our public schools than with a PTA Rally Day? 51 hashtag 1LISD students had the chance to meet with lawmakers and show their support for public education. Students asked questions about proposed legislation and learned what it takes to play a greater role in civic responsibility. So much to be proud of what's happening right here in our district. Congratulations to these amazing students and staff and the supportive families and communities who helped make Leander ISD the best place to be.